From a Shawnee Mission East high school graduate to now a children's book author, Phoebe Unterman wrote the book Through Eva's Eyes. It's about her grandmother's experience living as a child in concentration camps and surviving the Holocaust. Phoebe and her grandmother, Eva Unterman, are here to share their incredible story. Thank you both. Yeah, let's start off with you. Uh, my gosh. This book, uh, are you so proud of your, of your granddaughter? I'm incredibly proud and happy that Phoebe was, is interested in our story and that she wrote and illustrated uh, all this book, which yeah. is most unusual. Phoebe started at age 13, and when you look through it, besides reading, the illustrations are done in great detail. Mm -hmm. She remembered everything I mentioned to her and has done with a great deal of sensitivity. I'm very proud and happy indeed. It is amazing, a great story too. What Thanks. inspired you, Phoebe? Um, well, from like an early age, I heard my grandma speak about her story because um, she used to speak to a lot of schools. And so after hearing her speak, um, I heard of this contest, this um, written and illustrated by contest that I was gonna enter. And I thought that this would be a great story to do because it's like the story that I've always been most inspired by hearing um, of my grandmas, and so I decided to write and illustrate about it. Eva, what, what do you want people, uh, children, even adults, I mean, this book, uh, you know, it can be read by anyone. What would you like for them to take out of it when they read this book? Well, I think it's so important that those of us who survived remember uh, what occurred and the people who didn't weren't as fortunate as we were. I often think, having been a child at that time of the approximately million and a half of Jewish boys and girls that were killed during the Shoah, and so to remember them, and I see Holocaust education as remembering the past and educating for the future. Absolutely. Yeah, and also it shows a lot of courage. You know, this talks about so much. Um, there are a lot of great lines here that just makes you just reflect about uh, that particular time, that period. In this uh, book, um, you write about how your grandmother, uh, she remembers uh, when uh, you were like sitting at the table, you'd go around the house and you'd remember your mom and dad, they'd always be whispering, whispering, Correct. and you knew there was something going on. But you were a child. I was six years old. Yeah. I felt very protected, but I was also curious, so I tried to yeah. listen on. Great story. Saying. So, Thanks. what are you doing, Phoebe? What are, what are your plans? What are you studying right now? Um, I'm a journalism student at the um, University of Southern California. Okay. So, I'm just back on spring break and um, for this... Um, book thing event tonight. So. Great. What kind of journalist uh, do you want to do? Uh, um, I'm do you doing wanna... print and digital journalism okay. is like the official title, so I'm not really sure yet, but okay. I'm just a freshman. Well, you yeah, got plenty so. of time. Yeah. Yeah. Well, whatever you do, I mean, she's already successful. She's already a children's author, and she uh, is writing an incredible family story for many to share. Thank you both for being here on the show. And you can meet Phoebe as she talks about her book along with her grandmother. That's tonight at 6.30 at the Kansas City City Library Plaza Branch. Thank you both. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.